everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I was very, very excited, but now I'm a whole mix of things. I'm now starving because Katina and I, along with our friend John, we hiked up this massive like 600 meter hill nearby, but I'm excited because I am back in the great city of Glenrothes, Scotland, in the Fife region, just like every time I've been in this area. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> back here at the Foxton Bar and Grill here in Glenrothes. I was here back in 2013 and I completed their Scottish Meat Feast Challenge. A big thank you to Martin and Roddy for having me in and then of course the head chef Jason who created all this but I've only got 40 minutes to finish their holy guacamole burrito challenge and I must say <laughs> holy guacamole this thing is freaking huge. Will I beat it in 40 minutes? I don't actually know, but I'm gonna do my best. It's pretty much a triple meat burrito. There are five tortillas on this thing. There's lots of sour cream. There's a whole bunch of guacamole. There's actually like a Mexican cheese that's spicy. Filled inside here, we've got rice, chili beef, con carne. There's a whole bunch of cold peri peri chicken, which is in their homemade sauce. And then there's a bunch of spicy chorizo, which also they mixed in with the chicken. So those are the three meats. And then all around here, the big mo there's a whole bunch of their chips loaded with more sour cream, guacamole, their homemade pico de gallo. We've got some peppers here. We've got so much food. 40 minutes. If I fail, it's going to be 40 quid. But if I do win, I'll get my entire burrito meal for free, and I will be the very first person on the Wall of Fame for beating this challenge. Let's get this challenge started. All right, lots of people here. We cannot disappoint. 40 minutes. This is a lot here. We're just going to shut up and eat and see what happens. And we've got, of course, the Foxton to cheer us on, along with his new buddy, Leonidas. One, two, three. Boom. All right, and I do have my big spin. That is a spicy burrito that chorizo in here, but it is good. Jalapenos too. I'm gonna tell you the weight of this thing at the end. Because then if I lose, I can blame it on the weight. And then if I win, I can say, look at me, look at what I did. All right, we do have this out. I'm actually gonna try to eat this since I can actually eat it kind of clean. Three minutes, 35 seconds in. Five minutes in, all I can say is holy guacamole. This is a lot of food. But I'm feeling strong, we're gonna get it. Once I'm done with this part, I'll feel a little bit more confident. I don't really know what I finished the uh, Scottish meat feast in back in 2013. Final time, 29 minutes and 40 seconds. Heck, I don't even really remember what I ate. That was forever. A thousand challenges. I must say, this burrito is freaking delicious. There's just so much of it. Now we're gonna knock out the middle and the rest of the tortillas. Then it's just basically a taco salad. Almost done with the burrito. We're 13 minutes, 30 seconds in. We're gonna get it. Remember, we've got 40 minutes. I 
actually think I'm done with a lot of the burrito. Now there's just a S word ton of chips. Once I have my soda, that's gonna help it all go down. Now we're just mixing it up. Hey, you're my favorite. All right, we do have a cold soda. Not sure what it is, but who cares? Let's just eat. 16 minutes, 15 seconds in. I am so glad this is 40 quid if I lose because that kind of is where the 40 minute time limit came from. I think we're gonna get it. We're 18.05 in. Alright, we just hit 20 minutes in, which means we have under 20 minutes to go. Slow and steady wins the race. With how much I've smashed all these chips up, if I get sick, I can just put it all back in the bowl and it'll look the same. I'm just kidding. Now I'm letting all the sauces soak into the chips so they go down easy. I'm having Jason bring me a white plate and then I'm gonna put the rest on there to make it easier for everybody to see how far I've gone. If you wanna try this challenge in the future, have no fear, it's gonna be a little smaller than this. I didn't wanna waste all the food and there was no way to change it up without making it look bad. This platter was supposed to be like five and a half pounds and it's 7.9. And I wanted to do this because it's training for a challenge I have coming up in a few days that is unnecessarily big. Thank you, Jason. So we are at 24 minutes, 16 seconds. This is what we have left. We have over 15 minutes to go. What I'm most sad about is that Jason's partner, congratulations to them, they're having a baby, but she said that if I finished exactly in 27 minutes, she would name the baby after me, but... <laughs> We're at 25.45 now and it just can't happen. I know you can't hear them, but these two just won't shut up. They're having a great time. Lee and I just loves going on these trips. Especially now that Katina's with us too. Aww. As I learned in England years ago, I do my finest work when there's a guy that doesn't shut up the whole time and only says, go on lap, like every four minutes. I think I need that. Somebody just give me a good, go on lap, go on lap. Come on. 29 minutes, 10 seconds in. The one thing I do know today is that the two hour hike that we all just did, Katina, John and I, all those calories came back in this burrito and a lot more. But I gotta tell you, this has been so good. The peri peri chicken along with the chorizo and the chili beef has been a great combination. We're almost done. As I learned weeks ago at Guapo in Derry, Northern Ireland, Northern Ireland Mexican food is delicious, and what I've learned today is Scottish Mexican food is excellent too. Big thank you to Jason and everybody here at the Fox Den. We now have the winner. I think I really could have won in under 30 if I truly just shut up and I don't really know how to do that. On the first winner, the time to beat, 31 minutes and 32 seconds. <laughs> I've already talked very highly of it off and off the video, but the peri peri chicken, the chili con carne, the chorizo, all of the meats in there, everything was amazing and they do have burritos on the menu, so even if you don't want to try this challenge, They've got normal common folk muggle size burritos on the menu, and then they've got so much other food. Everything looks great. So if you're ever around the Glenrothes area of Scotland in the Fife area, uh, be sure to get here to the Foxton Bar and Grill. Thank you guys all for coming. For me, it was overall victory 
1103. I am going to get my 40 quid or 40 pound meal for free. I will not get a sweet t-shirt, but today they are one-upping us. We're going one even better. They are going to let me keep the uh, fox so that uh, Leonidas has another friend at the house. So great to take the fox home. I appreciated all of his support throughout the challenge, but I will be the first person with my name and photo for this Holy Guacamole Burrito Challenge up on the Wall of Fame here at the Foxton. So not exactly sure where the next challenge will be, but yeah, we'll see where the next challenge happens. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah. Feel free to talk, cheer, do whatever you'd like because the main uh, video is gonna have music to it. <coughs> Posted in like four months. All right, we are very ahead. As you can see, these don't come from salads.